Hi, hello and welcome back to our channel. So today I am going to present before you how to customize website in Odo 40. So in Odo, uh, you have got a lot of options to customize your website. So taking aid of Odo website builder, end user can create stunning websites without much of a stretch. So website feature enables any common man to develop his own company's online presence without much no coding knowledge. So it publishes information about the company and on the other hand, it can act as e-commerce site, HR recruitment portal or customer portal. Okay, so you can see we have two web already created two website, my website and my website too. Now let's go to uh, dashboard and go directly to our website. Okay, so here we can see my website and my website too. And here we can see some menus like home, shop, events, forum, blog, courses, contact us. And we can see the, the total products added to cart uh, by the user, customer. Okay. And uh, before going to other menus, here we can find option to add new page or new blog post or event, forum, job offer, product or course to your website page. Okay, so if I choose page, I can create a new page like uh, my special events and if I wish to add this page, uh, that is if, if I wish to add menu to my website page, I can enable this option and after that I can click continue. Okay, so the page will be created with a menu and you can publish this okay so before publishing let me edit this page okay so here we can add building blocks to your uh, website page like uh, you can see a lot of options text with image pictures then a uh, lot of widgets or snippets available then dynamic contents like website form so uh, we have done a separate video on website form builder in Odo 14 community, so you can check that. Then, when you select an object, uh, you can see styling options for each object. That is, uh, for website page itself, we have styling options, but not only that, for each object, we can change uh, styling. Here, we can see some options like we can change the background color. Content width height uh, for this title. Then we can also find other customization options. That uh, options that is to customize your theme. Here we have theme options, button uh, input settings and all. Okay, so after adding uh, these things, you can save the page. Okay, now we can. Uh, publish the page on website so you can see you have published your page okay in the same way we can create a new products new or events and all then here after creating a page you can see option to edit menu uh, that is we can delete edit menu or we can add mega item menu item or mega menu then here we have option to manage pages and we can also see the current page properties okay so if you click on manage pages uh, we can view all the pages its url and we can sort by url name and we can search for pages we can uh, manage the pages and uh, see whether that is optimize seo page seo of this page we can see whether it is published we can delete I mean, we can clone page. Okay, so if you choose a particular page, so here we have our my special events, and here if I see the page properties, you can see uh, some details later to name and publishing of that page. So we have done a separate video on how to create and manage layout of uh, that is pages. Uh, change layout of pages in Odo 14 website community so you can check that video uh, you can check the description box or you can find the link for the video okay 
okay and here we can see other pages also now here we have our shop so for our shop you can find a lot of customizations like you can see option to add features and we have HTML, CSS, JS editor for customizing page. And here we can find a website search box. Then here we can uh, find options related to uh, product item products. So first thing is we can add uh, products to cart directly from here. So when you enable this option, add to cart. Okay. For your product, you can find uh, from here itself, we can add products to cart. Okay, so now we can come to check out or make payment. Okay, coming back to shop. So you can see one product is added to cart. Then here we have find option that is to view the comparison list. So it is already enabled. So here uh, we can add product to our comparison product to comparison list and we can compare attributes and choose suitable product. So here we can click on this and add product product to comparison list and we can compare products. Okay. Then we can find option like product description. So when you enable product description, you can view description for the product. So you can see warranty issue to purchase of an article by its manufacturer promising to repair or replace if uh, it if necessary with within a specified. Okay, so when you uh, just open this product, here we can find the description and if you wish to edit and change the description, you can edit from here. Then we can view wishlist button so you can add product to wishlist from here okay so you can see we have added product to wishlist so you can add product to my cart but keeping wishlist by using this option and you can add product to cart then here we have option to view products as grid or list button so here you can see uh, this is the grid view we also have a list view for products so from here we can view products in list view then we can also view images product images is full then here we have we can set in list view as default view then we can also add product attribute filter so when we enable that option here we can filter products by attributes so we can see uh, for leg steel we can see two products then we can see color blue uh, one product it's unpublished So like this, we can filter products by attributes. Then we can uh, show sort by. So here you can, when you enable the option, you can sort these products by uh, catalog price from high to low, low to high, then name A to Z, Z to A. So you can find sorting options for products. Then we can also view e-commerce product categories. So when you enable that option, you can view the product categories. So if these are all the products. Then if you want to, uh, if you wish to view all the chairs, you can click on chairs. Also here we can find all the chairs. And if you wish to compare these chairs, you can just add them to comparison list. Okay. Then it is also possible to collapse the category list so these things are expanded before it was expanded so it is also possible to collapse the comparison list then we can also track uh, track visitor 
so we can track visitors of a shop e-commerce shop or website okay then we can search for products from here okay so we can search a product and we can view the description name of the product and total price which can be tax included or excluded okay now now when you choose a particular product uh, that is you can see the product page so here also we can see a lot of customizations that is features available that is we can view alternative products so if you have added alternative products to your product you can view alternative products and after comparing with the alternative product you can add products to cart okay then here we have option to automatic image zoom then we can view uh, buy now button uh, from this page so without adding to cart we can directly buy the product from here okay so directly we can make the payment then um, we can also see discussion and rating so we can add rating reviews on product so when you enable that option here below you can see average rating total stars then here we can add rating and this can be sent okay now below you can see the rating done by mishlerning and here now you can see four stars and average rating of the product okay then here we have some other options like we can view list view of variants if you have if the product have variants Okay, so if I choose conference chair, and if you enable list view of variants, okay, so here will be uh, we can see all uh, the variants list. Then product attributes table. So we can uh, enable this option to view the product attributes table. Then we can see recently viewed products. So if you open a products and when you come below, you can see recently viewed products. Then it is also possible to enable customer to select quantity. So it is already enabled. So we can change the quantity of product. then we can see option show extra fields then terms and conditions so it is already enabled so here below you can see terms and conditions of this product uh, so for this you can see 30 day money back guarantee then wish list button uh, that is we can add product to wish list from here so you can see that option here already added then track visitor to track the visitor of the product okay so these are the customize uh, customization available uh, to customize your uh, website e-commerce shop okay so if you have any doubt regarding this video or related topics you can uh, please add your valuable comments below if you are interested in knowing more about this or looking for any order implementation or customization in your business drop your request to order at cyprocess.com Thank you.